Capitol Christmas tree came alive in Harrisburg this afternoon. Members of the Pennsylvania National Guard's 213th Area Support Group counted everyone down on two big screens, live via satellite from Iraq. Very cool. And family and friends of the soldiers were able to see their loved ones, some for the first time since they were deployed in June. That a Capitol tree is a 21-foot-tall Douglas fir with 7,000 lights and close to 500 handmade ornaments. It was originally going to go in the White House, but it was too big for the White House, so we took it. And the, yeah. real, the real Christmas present comes in the spring when they come home safely, yeah. hopefully from Definitely. Iraq. You got it. Yeah. Uh, while we got the storm uh, that we need to be concerned yeah. about tomorrow, uh, some of our concerns, uh, basically a combination of some light snow, sleet, freezing rain. I'm emphasizing more the sleet and freezing rain, and we'll see some light accumulations of snow, but uh, uh, many of us could see maybe a one to three inch accumulation of some sleet and snow. This is primarily tomorrow morning through tomorrow evening. It's a quick mover. I'm thinking around sun up tomorrow, and there you can see the impacts would basically be the commutes, both of them, and schools could be talking about delays, and then, of course, your shopping plans. Sleet and commute, not a good combination. Not a good combo, no. Thank you for being here. World News is next. And we're back here with all the latest local news at 7. Until then, have a good night. Welcome to World News. Tonight, the...